Hi guys, uh, this is Sham. Uh, today we are going to learn a very important thing uh, that is called the technical data sheet. So technical data sheet is uh, basically used for every raw metal, every plastic raw metal and uh, it's majorly used for its uh, testing and uh, mechanical and chemical properties. So mostly the mechanical properties of uh, the raw metal. So every uh, whatever the machine parameters and whatever the testing parameters is, is uh, used is based on uh, this uh, document only. So every material has uh, its own technical sheet. So uh, based on this, they refer this and all the properties which you need to, you know, uh, they refer using it's a bible of uh, all the plastic raw metal. So we are going to uh, see a specific raw metal. It's called a PC ABS. So PC ABS is basically alloy of the PC and the ABS raw metal. So as you can see, they have mentioned the properties, uh, the mechanical properties, and uh, they have this uh, tensile strength and uh, tensile stress. So uh, they've given like uh, what is the yield point, what is the uh, breaking point. Specifically, they mentioned the typical values and uh, the test method also they mentioned. So what is the test method? It should be tested. So you you can you know you know the the spec of this uh, parameter can be based upon this typical values. And uh, below you can see the impact, the IZOD impact testing. So you must have heard of IZOD and CHAPI. So that is what the uh, you know the parameter is about. So IZOD impact testing. So so this uh, chemical is based upon uh, supply called SABIC. So SABIC is based on Saudi Arabia Chemical Corporation. So what they do is uh, they have they have only provided this technical data sheet. So as you can see, all the parameters also mentioned here. Uh, what is the isot impact what is the thermal properties and uh, you know the, the pretty much all the physical properties so these properties can be used to set the you know the machine uh, whatever the during injection molding the smp is based on this only and uh, you can see all the you know the specific gravity and the melt flow index and um, uh, shrinkage rate and everything so what is uh, I've explained to you in the previous video about this MFI how to test the MFI so they've also mentioned this melt flow rate so melt flow rate is the MFI value so they've mentioned like uh, how much of a 260 degree it should be checked at uh, 5 kg so I've uh, showed you in the last video also uh, how how much uh, the metal should be heated up so that's the value uh, uh, from which uh, it can be taken from here so this TDS is the reference of uh, the testing of uh, MFI value. So below they've again uh, mentioned everything regarding the drying temperature and uh, the properties. You know the uh, the moisture content. So every every batch whenever it receives in the company, they usually check the moisture content of the raw material. So they've mentioned here, right? You can see it's uh, moisture content 0 0.02. Okay, so it should be maintained to that level. So they check the moisture even i have explained in the previous video also how to check the moisture content and you can see all the parameters here right the nozzle temperature the zone one temperature these are all the uh, basic uh, parts of the injection molding setup you know the, from the hopper uh, and uh, each band how much their temperature should be maintain and how to, how much temperature should maintain the barrel so they've also mentioned this one also so pretty much you can find everything about the about a material in this uh, tds so that is the end of the page so almost i have covered everything right from the moisture and from the mechanical properties from the tensile strength so tensile strength and uh, you know the uh, these things have a specimen you have to make a specimen of this raw metal and you have to put in the utm and uh, you have to test it so there is a separate procedure for that one so this is guys uh, this is a basic the tds a technical data sheet of uh, every raw metal so every raw metal has such uh, like this technical data so if uh, so how to check it in the google how to uh, you can also find these things on a google okay so they have uh, publicly they have uh, kept this uh, technical data sheet in the uh, internet also so you can uh, just go search uh, you know the technical data sheet of uh, whatever specific requirement you want whatever material you want so i have uh, checked for this uh, pc abs uh, is a specific grade so i just uh, typed it as uh, i need the technical data sheet for pc abs uh, what is the grade i have to type it so i'm searching it so i've just uh, i just got a number of search results so from there uh, i'm just going to click this one which uh, you know which matches the the requirement which i'm searching for so i've just seen this sabic uh, innovative plastic and about that uh, there is a grade and it's later like c c1200 hf and hyphen sabic so that's the thing i'm searching for guys so thank you guys